Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome back to another video. Today, we're gonna finish up the last three stages of Challenge Rush Goku, including all the challenges so we can get that title. So let's do all the intro and let's do it. All right, so here we are starting with Battle 6 and we're gonna start the challenge with the regeneration team here which is, um, yeah, Slug, Baby, and uh, Janemba. And just for the sake of brevity, I sped up the video and the gameplay by 35% because otherwise it's, I think, eight, uh, eight fights that I have to do and they would have been about 40 minutes long. And <clears throat> I just felt like that was maybe way too much. Nobody would watch that in one sitting, but I also didn't want to make two videos out of it because, I don't know, maybe it's just milking it or Ah, no dodge. Okay, yeah, so it's I don't want to milk it, but also it's just one event, so shouldn't be too hard to you know just like get it in one go. So I think it's gonna be around 30 minutes, and uh, you can just fast forward if you have to, if you just have like one specific challenge that is a problem for you. But we're gonna do them all, and there we go. Ah, that was too slow. So yeah, we're gonna fight against uh, Godku uh, for now with the three regen units, and then we're gonna do it with. Three Super Saiyans. Okay, can we do it here? All right, let's rush. And um, yeah, then I think I had to do it again for 120 counts because the units that I took that I thought were Super Saiyans don't have the tags. So if you're taking people that transform into Super Saiyans, they do not count. And yeah, obviously they don't have the Super Saiyan tag, so it is what it is. Wow, 15. 15 uh, standby counts. All right, so uh, we're about to just get the first health bar down off of the Godku here. And uh, yeah, trying to switch around as much as possible is kind of the prime thing that you're gonna do with Baby. Simply because he heals everybody back, so there you go. Okay, we can use the green. Is he already susceptible to immobilize? Yes, nice. So usually, um, I think at, for the first couple of counts, he is immune to that. But, oh, that was quite some good damage. And uh, here we go. Yeah, I really have to get used to that again because, yeah, the old Janemba also had that counter against blast uh, cards and tap shots. But it's just not a reflex to use a green card when the opponent does a uh, blast card, uses a blast card. But instead, I usually just vanish. And yeah, that's not so helpful. So here we go. Okay, so can we can we get the second rising rush here in a little bit? Um, and yeah, I wanted to record that video yesterday, or I recorded the fights yesterday, but I also wanted to publish it yesterday, but you know how it is, life gets in the way, and uh, yeah, we were pretty much busy cleaning out the entire apartment, and that means going through all the closets and getting rid of so many t-shirts, and I found this beauty here. I totally forgot that I had that, but I found it again, so I decided I'm gonna wear that when I'm recording, because it looks awesome even though the light and the chroma key filter make it a little bit less awesome right now. But um, yeah, it's the uh, Super Saiyan Blue Evolution Vegeta. And um, yeah, you know, bringing the stuff to the mission, going, you know, the Saturday is when in the, in the US, I think your stores are open on Sundays, but in Germany, the stores are not open on uh, Sundays. So you go into a grocery frenzy and all that stuff. So yeah, just time wasn't, timing wasn't great for me. So. I had to postpone until today. Okay, can we fit? Oh, no way. So we missed it by one count. It was so close. So you can do it with regen, but yeah, we're gonna do it with three Super Saiyans. And um, since I sped up, if you wanna see the equips, just, you know, reverse and then pause the video. But I was hoping I could have, um, you know, finished this one in 120 counts with the Super Saiyans, but for some reason they just didn't want it to. Okay, and... One more. There we go. Switch to Broly for some reason. I could have switched into uh, Bardock instead and gotten more crits. But hey, why would I, right? Gonna do that right now. And Gohan is almost back. Here we go. So now we can use the blue, uh, the blast cards, and get rid of them, most of them, and then rush. Just because, yeah, almost all of them are strike units. I mean, Bardock is kind of mixed. But I think he still has higher strike attack than he has blast attack. 
Broly for sure, Gohan for sure, so that's why I wanted to get rid of all the blast cards before rushing, and you see that that rush is not doing a lot. Ouchie! Okay, how much does that do? Oof, a third. I think I could have actually used the blue card here, and done the Mosenko, but this way... Kind of wasted, I mean, yeah, otherwise if I had switched, that would have been even more wasteful, but there is no unit that had to go from standby. So, that's why I... That was kind of a wasted card here. And we're gonna use the ultimate. Okay, let's see. Can we crit? I don't know, because I have no audio here. Because I recorded the fights kind of like here and there, you know, when I had time. And also, some of these fights are a little bit harder, so it's really annoying if you uh, if you want to record, and then you have to re-record it a bunch of times. Okay, so this should get him down to the last. No, there's one more. That's why. Okay. Wow, can you see how crazy that Gohan is? Holy moly. Here we go, getting another one, another combo in. Probably could have used the green card as well, but it is what it is. Okay, we're gonna use it to heal Bardock for 10, 10 HP. Oh man. Yeah, so the AI now also waits for you to, to vanish and then do the old, you know, sidestep. And that's kind of annoying because I, that's how I used to play a lot, or I'm still playing like this, is where I switch, then I uh, do one sidestep, usually the opponent sidestep as well, and then you can start your combo. But that doesn't work anymore. So sad. So sad. And uh, so I yeah, have to start adjusting my playstyle a little bit. Okay, that's not going to be enough. That is. Okay, can we get a rising rush here? We can. And it's 81 counts, so if this kills, we would have been able to kill him in, you know, within 120 counts. So it's it's possible with either team, but it's just so close. So probably there's yeah, I mean I'm gonna show you a team that is much, much easier in a second. That can do it, you know, without any issues. But yeah, so we have two challenges out of three, and this is the team that I'm using now, which is uh, Super Gogeta, Cheat Goku, and Bardock. And we're gonna start off with the Gogeta because he transforms after 10 counts and it's kind of useless to have Bardock start when there's not really a Super Saiyan in the team that can kind of benefit from his buffs. So we will transform and then we will use the blue. And if I'm not mistaken, I should switch into, okay. I would have should have switched maybe into Goku then because uh, he can transform now. But I don't think that he will get the buffs from Bardock just because he wasn't a Super Saiyan when he switched in. But since there's no audio, I'm not sure if I crit it or not. Yikes! Okay. And that was too late. I'm gonna switch into Bardock here, splash some damage, we still need that Goku. <clears throat> and... Yeah, just... Use that, and rush. There we go. And I should have used the Strike card instead just because... The yellow, uh, the, the green card is um, an average between blast and strike, which is always better than you know the type you're uh, you're not. And since Gogeta is a, a blast type, using a strike card does less damage, so whatever. Oh come on, don't kill me! No! Oh Jesus! Mm. Okay, good enough. We are still alive, and we critted him into oblivion. Pretty awesome. There we go. Can do that again. Wow, almost one and a half health bars. And see, they also they, they are now doing different patterns. So here he was just backdashing for those people that like to use tap punches. And we are going to rush again. Are we? I'm not sure. No. So I'm saving the rush for the next. Okay, good. Saving it for the next uh, HP bar. But the blue card, I'm not saving for anything. All right. Time to save us from the crit, uh, from dying. Okay, Bardo can heal. And this should be, yeah, we can do both. Great. Which means that one health bar left. How many counts do we have left? About 40-ish. Come on, what can we do? Can we kill? 
kill, 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 kill. And this takes forever. And yeah, that's why I sped it up because 40 minutes? I don't think anybody would watch that. Okay, so there we go. So that's how you do stage number eight. Stage eight. And um, now we're gonna do stage number nine against Super Suit Saiyan Blue Kaioken. And the first challenge is using two God Key units at least. We're gonna use three, we're gonna use all red. So yeah. And that was a force of habit thing for <laughs> for beam type special attacks, and I should have not done that. But yeah, I could have forward dashed and just done a quick charge, and that would have been enough, but this way I just wasted one uh, one blue card. It's okay. I have to say um, that this stage is probably the easiest one of the last three, and I managed to do this one relatively easily, and uh, yeah. Good. So, I did this because then I could have I could chain one more strike and I could rush with uh, with Rosé rather than with Whis. Okay. So, we are at seven. I'm gonna say he just goes down to five, maybe five health bars, because. Six even, they don't take that much damage. And I don't have reaction time ever. Okay. Ah. Okay, lucky for me, and I should have used my Yeah, I should have used my ultimate here. That was stupid. But that's also the reason I'm not switching, because I get the free combo now, so I can uh, I can ultimate and we will heal with Whis right after this. Alright, there we go. Heal, use one of the greens, and get the hell out of there. That's what I wanted to do, and I probably could have used his ultimate there as well, but I didn't. It's okay. And as you can see, he is taking a ton of damage from that god coup. I didn't even care to check the, the boost units until after I did this, and yeah, he's taking a lot of damage. And we still have 50 counts left. Look at that. And he's already down to the last two health bars. 43 counts left. So that should not be a big problem here. Choop. Thank you for that. And we can pretty much rush him now with God coup. And hope that this kills. Because for some reason he, he healed. Did he transform? I didn't even... Man, I am slow today, but... Either way, still this shouldn't be a, a big thing. Okay, come on, come on, one and a half million. Can we get him down? Uh, 700k left and we have so much time. Misclick here. Okay, we can switch. Is that the last card I need? Nope. That is the last one. Okay, so we did that with 20 counts to spare. So if you're, you know, struggling with a team, just do this. Now we're gonna do the hybrid uh, challenge and we're going to use, uh, yeah, there's not so many red hybrid Saiyans or not so many that I actually leveled up. So I'm just gonna use B-Pan, I'm gonna use uh, Father Sun Kamehameha Gohan, obviously, and we're going to use uh, the future Gohan in order to, you know, have the death buffs once he actually, you know, decides to not live anymore. And I wanted to take B-Pan just because of her debuffs you know, she does poison, she does paralyze, all these things, which are really, really annoying to play against. Okay. And yeah, that was kind of to be expected that he would vanish. Hey, there's a green card. Let's uh, let's not kill him off yet. He didn't use his, his ultimate, which uh, debuffs the opponent entirely. So all this, you know, the blue buffs you saw at the top of the screen, right there. They're gone. He has one buff now, and I decided to keep him just to have one more switch option for now. It's okay. I mean, we're just gonna rush him and see how much we can get him down. We still have Gohan's main ability as well that can heal him and restore some key. Could have used that as well, but I went for the rush now, and I can still use the main later. Okay, he is immune to all the debuffs, which is obviously it's kind of annoying, but it's what it is. Okay, we get a beam struggle here. That's nice, Pan. Can you beat your grandpa? You beat your grandpa. Step aside, Goku. It's time for a new generation. Okay, now just die, Gohan. And here we go. Card drawing speed up. 
inflict the damage up. Everything is up, which is nice. Okay, so now we can use the main. Here we go, and you know, just do some more some more damage here. And boom, let's see. How much will this do? Well, that's okay. It was a decent enough combo. Okay, the key recovery is also insane. I recovered five key from a sidestep. And yeah, that was, I wanted to heal too badly, so. I wanted to heal and I decided to die instead. No, that's fine, attack, come on. Ah, oh, come on, can we not? Can you not? Thank you. Okay, so let's see, if that doesn't kill, we're just gonna rush and it's not gonna kill, but... And see, even even with hybrids, you can do it with 15, 20 counts to spare and no problem. So this stage is really easy. I don't think anybody would have big problems with that unless you don't have some of the units. That can obviously be a problem, but then just, you know, substitute one or two for different units and make sure that you have type advantage. So we're gonna now fight the last stage, which is Goku transforming from Super Saiyan to base form to you know, uh, Super Saiyan 4. And first challenge is do it with only three bl uh, bl 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 blue units. Yeah, nice try, bro. And the blue units we're gonna use are the same we used for the first of this video, the first challenge where we wanted to get it in 120. Okay, so we got the transformation. And now we can switch out to Bardock and Transform with Gogeta in a second. The good thing is now that has uh, now Bardock has the cheaper strike and blast cards, so that's cool. Transform, get some key back. Definitely not using our Rising Rush here because why the hell would we waste it on this? On this little shit. Seriously? Okay, there we go. Now we're gonna rush, because you know he's uh, he has no no buffs yet, or like he just started, he attacks us, so full health means that we can at least do as much damage as possible. Much damage as possible, wow. I cannot speak today. And um, if, you know, if, if he's almost dead, it doesn't make sense to rush. So rush early, but you also want to debuff your opponent if possible. So we're gonna see that in one, in a different team later and oh, he does so much damage. Okay, are we... And now I think we should switch to Gogeta, use the blue card. Crit all the way. Can we crit though? Come on, boy. That was definitely not a crit. All right, that was a crit because Goku's strike damage is so, so normally. So yeah, okay, he's almost dead. I don't know why I just did that, but I felt like getting it out of the way. And here we go. So, two down, two to go. It's still 11 million HP to go uh, to kill in total. So, that might still take a bit. Because, yeah, he has 5 million HP now, 6 million HP on the next bar. And he does not get weaker. Okay, there we go. So, this is good. How much more can we do, though? Can we get another card here? Nah. Yeah, so at first I was like, why is he transforming from, uh, what did I just do? Why is he transforming from Super Saiyan to base? But that's how it was in GT, I guess. So yeah, I don't have the story like clear in my mind right now, but I think that's because, yeah, he was going back to the base form and then he transformed into SSJ4 you know, with the golden monkey in between, which we didn't get here, but choop. nice. Thank you for that. And we're going to use the blue, so we have our rush ready as well. And I think that should about seal it. Here we go. We still have crits. But that was, yeah, I wanted too much. That was stupid. Okay, now we can use Bardock's blue, like Bardock's ultimate as well. There we go. And as you saw, 6 million crazy but yeah we can do this but what I found even more interesting is that there was a challenge to do it with two green cards uh, two green units and I was like what are you serious 
Ah, I could have used that strike, but it's okay. So he restores Vanish, but not enough. And he's gonna use something right there. Like So whenever he uses his main ability, the opponent, the AI, they will definitely throw you an attack right away, right there. So either they use the, um, the main card straight away, or they do a blast or a strike attack. So you can, right after that, just do a perfect Vanish and get the hell out of there. And yeah, as you see, this is gonna be hella close. We're down to 30 counts, 27. And we still have 900k, so we will get there, I think. But it's not fun. It's not as you know an easy challenge per se. Can I get one more card? Nope. Switch. There we go. And we can <laughs> legendary finish him. It's okay if we do it in PVE. If you do it in PVP and you go out of your way to get it, you're kind of a douche, in my opinion. So um, we're gonna go for the next challenge, and this is the team that I'm using. So GT Goku and GT Vegeta are boosted, and uh, the Super Saiyan 3 Goku is just there because he has that rescue ability and he has increased card drawing speed, which means that we can then, you know, um, get the Rising Rush faster, farm it. Can we get another card here? Well, of course we're gonna get a blue card. And use it, there we go. And we're going to use uh, Vegeta's main as well and get that blue card off. And we already have our Rising Rush for the next stage, which is nice. Choop. Okay, this should... Yep, okay, there we go. And we have the Rising Rush as defense. Ah, yeah, sometimes I just react badly uh, when the opponent is just doing a sidestep and I'm like, oh, he's doing something, Rising Rush, Rising Rush. <laughs> and then once you, you saw, you were like, abort, abort. But uh, it's too late, so. And yeah, that was also too late, but it's fine. Okay, can we... There we go. Nice. Come on, Vegeta. I don't think I need the blue card here. No, definitely not. Alright, so... Two down, 11 million to go as usual. And I misclicked here. Hoping that that would have been a different card, but it's not. And... Yeah, let's just go for this. Whatever I saved him, but it's okay. So I think now, before Goku dies, it's time to use his main. For one, he heals, and the other thing is that he has type neutrality, he doesn't care about type of disadvantage right there. So the damage should still be okay. Ish, I guess. Ooh, that was, yeah, see, there we go, that was throwing me off quite a bit. Okay, attack, attack. And rush. So how much can we do here, though? Is it gonna be anywhere close to enough? I mean, we still have all characters alive, so the rush isn't going to be crazy strong, but uh, two and a half million, that's not too great. Come on, do something. Thank you. Problem is now Goku's cards are more exp more expensive already because uh, the, what is it, 60 counts are done. Kind of, kind of annoying, but can't do anything about it. He has to be nerfed at some point, right? Okay. <laughs> I just kind of wanted to do that here because the blue chains, so it just felt like do it and then switch out after the next vanish and Vegeta is going to just do his job here hopefully yeah so we have 19 counts left can we do it can we do the 6 million I don't think so nope don't even think about it can we use that strike as well yeah I know with seven counts or five counts we're not gonna get rid of a half a uh, five and a half million <laughs> HP so, yeah, so this, uh, the, the objective now is just win this in the time that we still have left. Whew, that was lucky that he didn't just decide to do another sidestep because, yeah, they do that a lot. Okay. Okay, I think now he's, okay. He might let me guess it, but if even if not, it's fine. Like that Goku can die as long as Vegeta is alive and the GT Goku is also okay. You know, they help. Okay, can we get one more? No, close enough. Okay. So we have 50 counts ish left for 3 million HP. Ah, ouch. Okay, that was less than I thought, but that's because he has boosted uh, damage cut as well. And we can do that again. 
This is so annoying. These kind of blast counter greens. But this one only counters uh, blast cards, so it doesn't really counter tap shots. Can we kill? I only have 26 counts left, man. That yeah, because of I of the 135% speed up, so I sped it up to 135%, not by 135%, but oh, okay. So this is how you do it with two greens, and the last one will be how to do it with uh, within 120 counts. So we're just gonna use the standard GT team here. All of them are boosted. And you can, I tried it also with Vegeta, you know, the yellow one that we just saw in the previous match, but it didn't go so well, so I decided to just bring the full team here. Also because you can combo extend so much with both Goku and Vegeta, having this, you know, com uh, this regen for key. So we can now go to Goku and there we go. First health bar down. And we are going to rush here. Tuck. There we go. Okay, so from 3 million, how much can we go? I'm gonna say it's doing 2.5. Come on, come on, come on, kill it with fire. 1.9, that's lame. Nope, not gonna happen. That was too late for sure. Eh, don't kill my baby, I still need him. I shouldn't have did that, but it still worked, so it's okay. Okay, there we go 166 so we have still 86 counts left I'm gonna switch over to vegeta and use the final shine attack nope not gonna happen okay so we're going to use his main here and hurt come on hurt him and we click the, the blue card right after to see if he is if he attacks right away he's gonna get one in the face there you go Yes, okay, so if we use the final, uh, the ultimate, and it's on final shine, I think we should be able to get him down to his last health bar. Come on, do your thing. Yes, and we still have almost 60 counts. There we go, and we can rush him in a bit, but for now I'm gonna wait. Um, so you see the debuffs are building up on top of the screen, and I want him to be debuffed a little bit more before you know um, attacking with the rush just so we can do the maximum amount of damage there we go that's another one and that should be okay so we're going to use this well, obviously we're going to use a strike card he's a blast based unit and we don't want to use that blue card because that does the most 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 damage come on so one and a half million hp left <laughs> why did i try and sidestep here okay are you gonna rush me no okay I'm gonna use your attack. Cool. I appreciate that. Goku can probably finish him off if he would have gotten another card, but he didn't. But there we go. So this is how you do it within 120 counts. Easy peasy if you have all the units. So uh, just, <laughs> just to prove it, we're gonna go into the missions and get that title. And I hope you enjoyed this video. And I hope this helped you a little bit. So if it did, then consider leaving a like and subscribing to the channel if you're new. Um, yeah, we're going to just go and grab that title. I'm going to put some more cool videos in the cards over there. So I hope that I will see you all there. And uh, have a nice rest of your day. My name is Pomzor. I'm signing off. See you over there. Bye, everybody.